Hey guys, welcome back to the Handy Home Girl season two. Yes, it's season two. And I am very excited about this new season. A lot has been going on the last two months. I know I'm supposed to come back in September, but FYI, raising a child is hard. But I'm loving every moment of it. Um, I love my little girl, Royal Lynn. She's just the, the pride and joy of my life and I'm ecstatic to be her mommy. But here on the very first episode of season two, I'm gonna show you how I did a designer bedroom hack. I saw a designer bedroom on Pinterest and I fell in love with this design. But when you have a designer bedroom and you want that designer look and you don't have the designer budget, well, this is what I'm here for. I show you how to do it the handy homegirl way. So I'm gonna show you how I took this Batura Barclay, a research designer, and just fell in love with the types of uh, bedroom decor that this designer has. Here's the Batura Barclay room. And here's my bedroom. Pretty close, doesn't it? I know. <laughs> no, so I'm cocky. During the whole series on my bedroom, I will show you how to do these projects individually throughout the blog site. So when you get done seeing this episode on the overview of the bedroom, you can click to other areas of the blog and see how I put together the smaller projects in the room. I'm so excited about season two. I hope you guys are too. If you like anything on here, uh, like, subscribe. Follow me on all my various social social media sites. That's the handyhomegirl.com, um, handyhomegirl14 on most social media sites. And I have a handy homegirl tip for you. If you want a small room to look larger using your curtains or drapes, buy longer curtains, maybe 96 inches, 92 to 96 inches, and put your curtain rod closer to the ceiling. Longer curtains make a room feel a lot taller and a lot more spacious. All right, see you later. Bye.